Now the latest on the coronavirus situation. South Korea on Wednesday reported more than 600 new cases, the most since January. Experts are concerned this could be the start of a new wave. So to stop it, they're urging people to avoid unnecessary meetings and they're ramping up testing. Jang Taehyun reports. South Korean health experts say that the country is on the edge of entering a fourth wave of COVID-19 after recording 668 cases on Wednesday. This is the highest number of cases in 89 days when cases were falling after the peak of the third wave. Experts say that without additional virus prevention measures, the country could see more than 2,000 cases a day. Health authorities are making sure there are enough hospital beds to deal with such a surge in cases. And to slow the spread, Prime Minister Jong Se-kyun at a meeting on Wednesday said the government will ramp up testing. We used to offer free COVID-19 tests depending on the social distancing level or symptoms. From now on, we'll let people get free tests at all testing centers across the country. Health authorities will soon send an official paper to local governments saying when testing will be free for anybody. And as experts warn that this could be the start of another wave of the virus, authorities are advising people to keep alert about the situation. Please cancel unnecessary meetings and meet fewer people. There are infections from various daily spaces and the virus is spreading all over the country. It's hard to find a place where it's safe from COVID-19. Health authorities on Friday will announce any possible changes in the distancing measures for next week. More than 100 people in the country are severely ill from the virus. And with four additional fatalities reported on Wednesday, the death toll stands at over 1,700. More than 1 million people in South Korea have so far received their first shot of the vaccine. Chang Taehyun, Arirang News.